Can I eat these last two pieces of honey wheat bread? Oh. I heard that manatees are known as sea cows. Oh, I'm offended by the term sea cow. What do you have against sea cows? You'll get over me, Janet. There are plenty of aquatic mammals in the sea. Seriously, Zarlock? Are you gonna eat the lobster or just probe it? Mm hmm. Nope, not today. We're afraid he's gonna eat his emotional support potato. I hid the sour cream. You maul so many people. How do you sleep at night? I usually use what's left of their torso as a pillow. My smartwatch says keep moving or die. Mine says you're a manatee. You have achieved perfection. Take me to your leader. Yo, right here, dude. And here's the final portion of the cognitive test. Identify these three people. A. Lunch. B. Snack. C. That guy I chased down just to tickle. <laughs> this is why people should never build a snowman well drunk. You two have fun. Don't hurry back. All my cat friends are coming over, along with all their friends, who are also cats. Seize the day and conquer the world! Or take a nap so fierce that your face gets drool glued to a throw pillow. Sharon? No, I'm Carlos. I'm so embarrassed. Don't worry about it, Dave. Nope, not Dave. I'm Melanie. Sorry. Well, I'm gonna go meet up with Sharon. I seriously doubt that. My giddy up done did get up and get gone. How do I know you're not a hundred delicious sea turtles disguised in a manatee costume? I'm not. That's exactly what a hundred delicious sea turtles would say. Seconds left to play. Manatee scans the field. He spots an open receiver and lets it fly. <laughs> that was my only football. That's a shame, because I'm still hungry. You're right. This is the best way to deal with a Monday. You're up early. Yep. Shit! Where's your manatee friend? He said he was going where the water's warmer. I could get used to this. Why did the groundhog cross the road? He was looking for his shadow. But then he found that bar he's been in for the last two days. I'm going to order off the menu and just have whatever has fallen on the floor. Come on, Phil. Everyone's waiting for you to do the shadow routine. Ned? Ned Ryerson? Nope. I'm going to keep watching this movie over and over and over and... Hey, Manatee! Want to help me hunt for seals? No way! I'm a herbivore! Fine. We'll hunt for guys named Herb. Cool. You think I have it easy? You should walk a mile in my furry little feet. What are you looking at? I saw a spy balloon overhead. I don't want someone spying on me while I poop. You're being silly and paranoid. Later. Do you ever get the feeling that there's a bear standing right behind you? All the damn time. Tickle, tickle. People won't stop making jokes about that one time I walked into a bar. You think that's bad? All I did was cross the freaking road! My Super Bowl prediction? Drunk people will yell at the TV while dropping large quantities of food on the floor. <laughs> Hooray for football and drunk people! Did you watch the Super Bowl? No, I watched the Superb Owl. The what? The Superb Owl. It's sitting on your dorsal fin. That owl is not superb. It's average at best. Who? You, Carl. Hey, Jenny, check it out. This guy has your Uncle Dave down cold. <laughs> I'm feeling a little awkward. This is my first date with a manatee. 
You feel awkward. This is my first time using silverware. What's with the tattoo? All penguins look alike, but now everyone knows who I am. But you're not Sam. You're Benedict. Son of a bitch. Smell this. <laughs> smells fishy. Yeah, but does it smell fresh? No, it smells like hot garbage. Maybe we should just order pizza. With a side of garlic bread. Whoever told you that sharks always have to keep moving is full of crap. It's your choice. I can push this glass to the floor, or you can put that fish on the counter and slowly walk away. Have you ever partied with Cocaine Bear? Hell no. I get nervous hanging with my Uncle Ron after he's had a few Mountain Dews. Look, I can balance a ball on my snout better than any stupid seal. Hey, have you seen my tube of super glue? Maybe. I'm afraid the arm will have to come off. I'd like to get a second opinion. Dr. Sharky? It needs to come off now, and I'll get right on it. If you're not gonna wear pants, at least put down a towel. The Invisible Man and the Visibly Disgusted Wife Walking on two legs makes me feel so dignified. I almost hate to spoil the moment by pooping. Now roll around on the ground and scream as loud as you can. Okay. I never knew there was such a thing as e-mauling. Why are you smiling? I got a job at a theme park. How hard was the hiring process? Let's just say I had to jump through a lot of hoops. <laughs> Crap, rock in my shoe. This day can't possibly get any worse. Save the manatee. Save the manatee from being bored to death by this dolphin. And then I quit my job as an accountant to become a professional bowler, but, you know, they don't make bowling shoes in my size, so I... Is there something wrong with your baby? <coughs> no, he's just a little horse. Great wise cat, please tell us the secret of life. Go away, I'm pooping. If you remember only one thing about our meeting, I hope it's this. Sharks don't like to be tickled. Yep, I think I'll remember that. I'm a horse doctor, only in the sense that I'm a horse who happens to be a doctor. Thanks for watching. Check the latest episode and also playlist with similar episodes like this one. See you in the next video.